And a good Wednesday morning to you, Roger Hill of Weathering Heights. We're going to discuss the smoke layer that is uh, going to be affecting parts of northern Vermont and how it's going to get pushed right back out of our region and into Canada. This weather video is driven by 802cars.com, representing 802 Toyota, Twin City Subaru, and 802 Honda. It's all located off of exit 7 on Interstate 89. So on this Wednesday morning, these uh, symbols here indicate smoke. Um, and uh, the smoke is from source regions of uh, numerous fires, of course, in the Pacific Northwest, parts of Northern California, etc., etc. Et and uh, you can see where the smoke is, even as far west, west uh, being reported this morning, is Bellingham International Airport. It, um, smoke layers uh, basically extend into uh, parts of uh, southern Canada, and even as far north as uh, up here in parts of northern Manitoba uh, and, and locations like that. A lot of that smoke is in compressed into a little bit of a layer here and as you head further off to the east it's shooting uh, the gap uh, between a frontal boundary that is located right here you can see kind of with the cloud cover and uh, northern Vermont and some of that smoke has made it into very far northern areas of the state. Here we're looking at the uh, kind of broad picture here with the uh, smoke sources that are coming in out of these fires in northern California. Again there's some fires up in the some parts of Washington and into British Columbia, you can see a little bit of source regions there. And there had been some fires uh, near the uh, Great Slave Lake in that area, sort of western portions of Ontario, eastern Manitoba, in this particular area here. And uh, as a source region, that does not seem to be as, uh, as strong, but you can kind of see just one fire. And where's all that smoke going? Well, a little bit of a narrower plume, again, is entered uh, just north of the state of Vermont. Let's take a look at that with the... Uh, rapid refresh and this is what you can see here on this Wednesday morning now we have this uh, weather system that's pushing up off the coast and it will eventually kind of push out this smoke layer but this morning it is just in the vicinity of the Champlain Valley by the time we get into the later part of tonight and during the day tomorrow I think this is going to be pushed northward uh, we may have to deal with more smoke eventually as this is going to be running across eastern Canada and eventually into all of the northeast United States uh, over time here. But uh, this time around, it looks like we're going to get more pristine air being pushed in by that coastal low that's going to be tracking like this and then off the coast of Maine. Roger Hill, Weathering Heights. Thanks for watching.